Jesus, man. <coughs> yeah. Tobacco? <coughs> Tobacco at its finest. We'll do the tricks. It has been ages since this beautiful man has been on the channel. And gosh, does it feel good to have him back. I miss this dirty dog. He's getting a degree, folks. May the 6th, if you want to attend the graduation, and then it's on to work for this guy over here. I hope so. I sure hope I can convince this dirty dog to accept a extremely low salary and do uh, very hard work. Low salary as in like a penny an hour? Last time that I took out the Shenandoah, she absolutely abused me. Fell off, <laughs> dropped two fish, completely fell on my face that video. I don't know what's more dangerous, to walk on the land or the water. Oh yeah, I'm on the ground. Still posted it though, because I'm a human being. Yeah, you're brave. 24 hour, eat only what you can catch, revenge tour on the Shenandoah starts now with this beautiful man here. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, man. That was, was like... Slippery. <laughs> Homie stayed in bounds, though, and that's why we're here. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, there it is. Now we're making progress. Christopher Columbus is coming back. What happened, what happened this time? time? I tied you up. You tied me up. I don't like being tied up. All right, gravy. Me and you. We have one hour and 15 minutes till dark. And on top of that, Gravy's Lake was just hit by a flood and a tornado, completely stained red. Water's three foot higher above pool. Pressure's on, dude. Yeah. We're gonna start gravy with the weightless black stick bait. Hopefully the fish can see it. I'm gonna have to hit one in the head. This water visibility is trash. <laughs> Push comes to shove tonight, we can fish for catfish, but I'm really hoping we don't have to do that. <laughs> Oh, so sorry. Uh, there we go. Last time we were out here, we had two 35 pound thrust trolling motors. Today, we got five times longer lasting 55 pound thrust motors. Cause I definitely didn't lose the key to the pontoon. One thing I'm a little nervous about is the water is probably four foot higher, staying solid red. It's like a bloodbath out here. But I can hear the water flowing over the dam in the back corner, and there's a straight up waterfall on the back side of the spillway. Like a year ago, me and Gravy came out here after a flood and every John boat in the lake got washed over. It's not looking good, Grave. We have opted to do a little trolling, just fish for about an hour, hoping trolling some lipless cranks to our favorite fishing hole is gonna do the trick. Yeah, yeah. Derby's a hungry man. We gotta find some food. <laughs> All right, here you go. Hold them both. Hold them both? Yeah. Okay. Be what happens if they bite both? Oh my gosh. Do some praying. You just blew your kneecap out. <laughs> I did, dude. Jeez, you might need torn meniscus surgery after that. It's all said and done. I already had that. Maybe torn ACL. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, all good. What do you think our best chance is? I think if we wrap around, that's what my heart's telling me. Got some action up here to the right, your side. You bit? No Dude, bueno. Why don't you do a ooh to me again? No bro. bueno yet. <laughs> no go yet. Gravy, I don't know who would have guessed it, but we haven't caught a fish yet. No fish in 2023 yet. The good thing is we still have 361 more days. Oh, it does not feel that good to come out here and tell Shannon Noah who's boss and then have her just kind of, you know, in front of 100,000 people. Whip your safety. 
for shoot with us. Thank you. They're like hard here, here. It's lamps. <laughs> <laughs> One light, they're coming by sea. Two lights. Oh, the British are coming by lands. <laughs> this is not going good. The hell is going on? That's land of hunger right there. Ready? Step up. There you go. That thing is, was about as wobbly as my last relationship. Still standing though. <laughs> All right, left hand here. Left That's hand? That's my fault. Okay, That's like, was, a, it's was, like a game of twister. What the heck is what that? What are we doing? We got a lot of fishing rods yeah, we involved do. here too. Don't even worry about it, dude. Right foot up, up topsies. Right foot up topsies. That's my man. Shh. Got it. <laughs> Very slick. Very slick. Jesus. Big obstacle to overcome my head. Oh my oh. gosh. Oh, God bless America. And Lean me. over me. Oh. You got me. Oh gosh. You got it. Alrighty, oh, I'm over. Ah. There we go. Ah. There we are. No uh, sudden uh, movement. <laughs> oh yeah, there it is. Move my word. <laughs> Quit smoking, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. We got kids watching, brother. Gravy. The final Hail Mary of the night. We have a cast net. If you remember, two years ago, three years ago, I might have deleted the video because it was really cringy. Uh -huh. We caught a six pound bass out of the puddle where that waterfall we showed you guys is earlier. Look at that fish! Oh my gosh! Woo Boom! That yell is so annoying, dude. I get, I get annoyed watching that video myself. Yeah, yeah. So what happens with the lake is when massive floods happen, all this water rushes over, fish get stuck in that little area. We're hoping some dinner got stuck. We can cast that out. Hail Mary, me and Gravy, let's find some food. We ended up parking the boat about 50 yards on the other side of the cove, just cause the water is pushing so hard. Never seen it push this hard, but no matter the conditions, we're doing everything we can not to let the Shenandoah have its best. That doesn't make sense. What does that even mean? Wow. It is moving. Do you hear that? Jeez, don't nobody fall over and we're done. That is crazy. I'm gonna walk through the woods and see if there's a good area to reach this without getting swept away. Okay. Don't move. Oh, please be thorns. Sick. Hey, yo, is risking his life. Ah. Try and find the dinner. Ah. Oh. I do not like the idea of gravy walking through here. Also, don't like walking on the edge of a cliff with a light shining in my face. See a light. Oh, man. I see a light shining. Gravy, I think you're going to fall off if you come over here. Me? Yeah, I don't think you should come. Why? What's wrong? I just don't know. I, I might fall off. He's about to cave in. Dude, this is intense, bro. It's like a 10-foot fall to a washing machine, but like not a good washing machine. Having a hard time communicating because water is moving at such a high rate of speed, cannot hardly hear being like maybe 10 feet away from each other. Does not feel safe. Wish we just caught a bass earlier. We could be spooning in the pontoon right now. Well, AO is returning. Let's see what the verdict is. Very uh, worried this will be a bad verdict. I don't know. That's the best area, but it's a thorn bush and it's hard to see. It's really concave, like oh. the water has washed out to the ground. Oh man. So some ground can look good, but it might just fall. Oh nice. I so like when that. we go over there, oh. stay away from the edge. Okay. So go near the edge. Ha! Ah. Oh my gosh. Ah! Thick oh. liars, man. Keep them hands in the pockets because I don't want fryers. This is the only area with an open enough space to cast net. I've been talking about making a fish sandwich for my friends for like three years now, but stuff always goes crazy. That's 
throw is terrible. Nothing. Hey, here we go. First fish, baby. Oh! oh. No! <laughs> It could be the perfect bait that we need. Poor little fish nugget. <laughs> you, <would have> bought <laughs> you know the deal. <laughs> Man, it would be so cool if we pulled up and a fish was flopping in there. So we currently have one shaft. We can split it if you want. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, a good, it's a good snack for two maybe. I don't know about the camera guy over here though. Wow, Ayo has got some skill. How did you do that? Wow. Before we go any further, today's video is brought to you by ButcherBox. <laughs> Not my ribs. ButcherBox allows you to find high quality meats and seafoods that you can actually trust. They have 100% grass fed beef, free range organic chicken, pork that was raised crate free, and they have wild caught seafood. With ButcherBox, you have the ultimate peace of mind knowing your food's not filled with hormones and antibiotics. They raise these animals humanely with no secrets. You're not filling your four-year-old son with steroids and estrogen. ButcherBox has ultimate convenience. Ship straight to your door, free shipping, customizable plans. You can put whatever cuts you want into your box. I live in a really small town and we really just don't have very high quality butt around here. We have a store, gets like five good butts once a year. Granddad buys them all and the family just cooks them. Now, we don't have to worry about hogging all the butt because we can get high quality butt shipped straight to our door. Butcher box. Great deals on high quality meat can be hard to come by, but a butcher box, top quality meat for amazing prices is the norm. Sign up today, get free chicken nuggets, gluten free in your box every single month for a year. Do so, butcher box. Thanks for sponsoring today's video. Wow, at least we're catching shit. A couple of them? Wow. Nothing, man. I had the biggest load of the night. It was like six or seven. And then I hit a bush when I was scaling the cliff out of there and oh. ripped the hole in it. And they all just fell right back down into the water. Dang. Good news is I got four shad in my right pocket right now, screaming catfish bait. There you go. Good Lord. A lot. Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah. Oh. I'm sorry, but I'm so thankful for this spot too, because I've been waiting four years to hold you like this. <laughs> oh! Give me some of that. <laughs> We're off. <laughs> okay, that was almost perfect. That's sketchy. What do you think? Wow. It's like a mini camper. All right, gravy. Whoa, whoa. Welcome aboard. It's top heavy. Yes. <laughs> but the beautiful thing is, if we all three get on the back queen, uh, we're good. Okay, so we're all gonna, three gonna sleep on that, man. I can see that really happening. Where do you use the bathroom at? Yeah, where his pipes on So if you got our poo poo. Actually, I've just been using this little. Uh... You just pee in there. No, no, no. You just shove that jerker up the back end and let it fly. 
This video is going off the rails. <laughs> All we have accomplished this entire night is a few pocket shad. Your pants? You never pocketed a shad? No. I'm sure I make sure underneath not smell very good. The main reason I kept these bad boys, we're going to hook these up, put some baby fillets in them throw them out there overnight. Hopefully we can wake up to catfish, and if we don't, we're gonna fish the whole day till we catch some fish. Rough start, man. But I will not let oh, the man. Shenandoah beat us. No. Temperature is dropping. Now the only thing me and Gravy can do is go to sleep. Oh, boy. Breaking that at 360 angle. Yeah. We got a pillow. We got pillows. <laughs> no. Oh, gosh. I already said a little late night cuddles. It'll be all set. Got a beaver? I think it's the beaver. I've just never have a, had a beaver. That seriously joking. Did y'all not hear that? No, that out. I didn't see anything, but dude, I heard something climb up the bow. Oh, it's moving. Fishing pole? Oh, it's tugging. Oh my gosh. Dude, why do they wait till one in the morning to start eating? <sighs> We heard him pulling. We were just about to be asleep. Oh, oh my gosh. He's hung so on the roof. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> There's fishing line on the other side. Oh, outstanding. Great start. I need your hand, Gravy. What's the, what do you want me to do? Um, right there. Okay. Hold right, I got it, I got it. Oh, one wire sticking off, dude. Oh, we need you, buddy. You got it? Oh, you see it? it? What, what am I supposed to be doing? <laughs> Real so. Real? Okay. I'm, I was waiting on you. Let's oh. get him. We need to ah! eat. Oh, dude. Oh. <laughs> Why is that gross? No, oh, I don't do catfish. <laughs> Pocket shad, baby. Pocket shad. Perfect. Ugh. Eater, baby. Meal number one, buddy. God, he's been feeding up. Mixing it up a little bit. We'll be making Creole seasoning fish blackened catfish sandwiches. You eating this? I don't know about catfish. I don't do catfish really. You're yeah. missing out. I don't know about that. You are missing out. You ever tried flounder? I have tried flounder. You don't like flounder? I tell you what, after you eat this, you'll never touch flounder again. I don't know about that. Huh? Them corny as they're about to come out. <laughs> we have been trying for so long, man. Cheers to that. Fish Sammy. Cheer. Amen. Three, two, go. Mmm. How's that bread taste? I don't even think you got a bite of fish, did you? No, no, no. Mm. Hot. Yeah, Creole. Mmm. That Creole is something them. Yeah. Maybe you went hard on the spices. <laughs> I did, dude. I didn't realize what. I really hope Creole you got, was, dude. I really hope you got an extra pipe nearby because I don't think two people are gonna be able to share one pipe. Just when we thought we were going to bed as losers, yeah, we woke up as winners, full tummy winners. Get up, buddy. Mm -hmm. oh. We got some fish to catch, buddy. Oh my gosh. 
Okay. New day, baby. New day. Same loogies. Same loogies. <laughs> <laughs> Golly, man. <coughs> this thing's come out of nowhere every time. Yeah. We're going we're gonna to be out of battery. That's going to suck so yeah, bad. I'm already after like draining. See it, boy. <sighs> That's my boy. Unfortunately, both trolling motor batteries have died. One of them melted where the terminals are. <laughs> Completely useless. Dave is coughing up pounds of mucus. We need one fish catch to make this video whole. And I'm burning the Shenandoah to the ground. <laughs> Guys, this did not go how we planned for it to go. Tornado warnings at 4 a.m. waking me out of my dead sleep. Flash floods on this 24 hour eat. I don't know what you can catch. Journey. Just looking forward to some real food. Might go find a fast food restaurant joint nearby. Any suggestions? Drop them in the comment section down below. Thank you guys for watching. Squat! Squat! Yeah. Squat with it. Oh.